With less than a month to the start of the upcoming legislative session, advocates are wondering if Texas will expand medical marijuana access. Many are not hopeful, which is why some, for now, are focusing on improving the existing program. Monica Madden introduces us to a veteran fighting for expansion in access. It's greatly improved my life. Air Force vet Jeff Young knows the benefits of medical cannabis. To treat anxiety, PTSD, and mild autism. But he says accessing it is not easy in Texas. This is the only state with no formal large-scale access. The legislation and the laws are already there. We just need more access to what's been approved. The Compassionate Use Program, also known as TCUP, falls under the Department of Public Safety. Young says right now it isn't meeting the demand of Texas patients. PS so that they could issue those licenses at any time, increase competition, lower the cost burden on the patients, and increase supply to the market. So, At a recent DPS commission meeting, leaders say they're opening up applications for more licensees in mid-January. Be our intent to act immediately on those applications since that would put us square in the middle of the legislative session. There are people already waiting weeks, if not months, to get their medication. At the start of 2021, Texas had about 4,000 users and 263 approved physicians who could prescribe it. Both of those numbers have grown. As of October this year, nearly 39,000 patients and 643 doctors. Let the legis legislative session at least begin and see um, what momentum there may be. But Young worries as long as teacup doesn't meet current demand, Texans will look elsewhere for medical cannabis. It comes down to accepting that it's already here. The bottom line is it feeds the black market. Monica Madden, KXAN News.